and we're back with uh, our TV show. Is that a purse? I see some really, really bad shadows over there. Hey, dude. Is that a person? Oh, dude. Disgusting. Ah, uh, uh, there we go. Fixed myself. Oh, ew. I can meet him. Shh. Your great engineer. How That's marvelous. Awesome. I must say, Mr. Manders, my excitement is almost unseemly. Yes, I can see that. Step this <laughs> way, Professor. I will be right behind you. Manders. Manders, where the devil are you? I can't see a damn thing. Manders! We are the pig, Professor. We are all the pig. Oh. Ah. Gross. Dude, this is unsanitary. Can you imagine all the, like, diseases that are probably running through this? All the, like, STDs and stuff. Yeah, like, HIV in here, AIDS, syphilis, Maria. I really don't know what else you can get by blood except for uh, STDs. Brody. I knew there was people. Oh, you took your heart it's out again. And what? Ah, gross. Dude. I gotta walk through it now. Are you usually not disgusted by these? I climb in stillness now. Blue ah, water runs too. in my veins. Now I am clean. I carry the knife of this factory, the bowl of this mill. I am come to collect you from your fields and your furnaces. I will gather you into the white clouds. I will gather you to me, and I will take you home. That's a big hole. Oh, lumps. Oh, not comfortable, not comfortable, not comfortable. I see things moving, shadows and things. I am uncomfortable. I'm not happy with this. Dead bodies, butts, butts and stomachs and legs everywhere. Oh man. Okay. Imagine having your feet drenched in blood. I hope you didn't have any cuts from the amount of fall I did on them. No, I'd probably just... Can't imagine there'd be anything like cuts, but he could have a broken bone, and the bone could have just went through some of the skin, and then you know, the blood just kind of seeped into that hole. It's got to be painful. The veil lifts. The bride is waiting. Round up some orphans, and the world will thank you for it. Disappear a whore, and a gentleman applauds you. Call a beggar. And a lady walks safely again. Yeah. Essentially.
big room. We're back here. Oh, more! Christmas! 1899. If you should find this, you already know all I would tell you. You already know what you have done. You know what must do. Walking away from those temples, that small pile of stones beneath the rhododendrons, the skulls of innocence under the loose cloud. Headless ribcages cruelly torn asunder to expose their flowers. The cool stone behind the altar is 3,000 miles away. I trace my life to this instant. Rain channels eroded in ancient stone. The toxins are already in this damp, this falling water. And in that instant, cradling my children's heads in my palms, I knew that I had to unbuild what I myself had constructed. Though even then it was little more than a sickening dream. This machine is ever mine, and it falls to me to retreat him. The, to redeem it, and myself. Alright, alright, alright. <clears throat> More doors? Oh, okay. so much reading, I can't walk five feet without reading. In my dreams, I walk with my children. I walk tunnels where no human has trod before. I am sure of that. It is just me and him now. Frost forms on my coat sleeves. The deathly still in the freezing air tells me that I am close. Can I open the door? No, I can't! Vacuum of eviscerators. Vacuum of eviscerators. This all must be the vacuum of eviscerators. Trippery pre-grinding. Trippery pre-grinding. Okay, so I have to go this way. Viscerators, viscerators. Scalding hoses? Scalding hoses. The sausagery. Sausagery. What's up, guys? How you doing? Where are we at? But why did you take my children? I, Mandus, of all the blood we have spilled together. The first drops fell from your hands alone. Then I am damned for a filicide. And everything is lost. Uh-huh. <laughs> Alright, so where are we going? Mandis Processing Company. We're going distribution tanks. Maintenance area. Hello? Oh! Was disturbing. Okay. Alright, guess there's not much other place. Ow, could you stop blinking? <laughs> <Man, it's... clears throat> not much there anyway. That way, so... What's this? Danger, do not expose to ultraviolets. Contains Vitae. Ultraviolets. Oh, who got murdered? Who done got killed? Who, well, besides practically everyone in this facility. Stop it! 
Stop it! Shaggy! Das, 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 das! Didn't hit it! Oh! I'm dead? Okay. It's a mastermind! Horsey! Horsey! Where are you? Betsy! Stop that! I don't like this place anymore. That's a new guy. That's new. That's, Let's agree to never do that again, please. Like ever. Ever again. This ought to be where the 15 minute mark is, isn't it? Three, four minutes. Ah, alright. I don't want to go and place big things like that again. No. Stop it! Stop, I don't... Laboratory. Oh no, that's gonna be scary. Mendes Processing Company. Electrogravitic Electrogravitic Suppression. So power. Electrogravitic. Gravitic. Suppression South Tower, okay. We're going through! And this descending amongst the spirits. The Aztecs believe they could avert the apocalypse through sacrifice. History tells us they failed. <laughs> the tragedy was simply that they could not spill enough blood in time. Okay. What to do, what to do. Oh, yes, let's move. Satellite room, South Tower. Didn't have to read it. Oh, good. Only to save you. Only to spare you. I would have given my soul to spare you this world and its loan. Oh, my children. My children. What have I done? What have I become? Well put it right, my darlings. All of my wrongs will be righted. All of my sins washed clean. Wilfred. <clears throat> Sticking your butt up at me. 20th of December, 1899. Memories. They surfaced like bloated bodies rising to the scum of the Thames. I looked at them. Covered in the blood of their dead mother, the little piglets squalling in their swaddling, and my heart at once was filled with a great love and consuming hate I could never have imagined. At that point, did my soul, did my soul split, creating him? Was this the egg of my soul, the moment of great clock begin to tick? Is it the only path to redemption to join us together again, to make myself whole, to close the great circle? and take that madman into my heart once more. Forgive him, myself as well. Come along, Wilfred. Dad's not the move button. I love you, my darlings, and I am sorry. I am sorry for all I have done. I simply loved you all too much for this world. Oh no. I search for instruction, for advice, for helping my goals, but in return the system mocks me, Simpleton it says. You must find your own answers now. Come on, Wilfred. Let's go. 
হচ্ছে Mandus put aside your misguided crusade and let me save them you may hate me Mandus but i have seen the future your 20th century and let me tell you this a far greater slaughter awaits you there I seek to save the world by blood now before millions fall beneath history pushed under by blade bullet and gas I actually forgot this is the 21st century <clears throat> I almost said hey that's the 20th century now Touch me! Don't touch me! I'm gonna go past ya! I can't run! Oh! I also couldn't see because I forgot my flashlight. Uh. Behind me! Behind me! Stop it! Don't appreciate this! Stop! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop! Okay! Ah! I'd like to at least know how this is happening. What's this? Stand where the blood was. Am I supposed to do something? Put this. I'm supposed to mess with this. Mess with that. Okay, what am I doing? Besides running around aimlessly. Am I supposed to do something over there? Just, oh. Okay. Ah. Uh. It's about the time for the ending. And we're back. I'm getting sloppy with this, aren't I? It's... I just touched it. I just touched it! This is pretty. Enoch Edwin 
Oswald and I. Oswald. Wow. That uh, I don't really know what to say. <laughs> Other than it's pretty bright. Madness, listen to your heart. You know you are with me. You created me to save the world. I am your friend. Is something stabbing your crotch? Look at him. Looks like he has something in his mouth, maybe? His mouth's open. There's his eyes, something stabbing his crotch. Can't tell if he's wearing anything or not. Something stabbing him in the chest? Huh. <clears throat> I guess I'm supposed to go back here. Look at these balls. Uvulus. Mandus, please, I am no more evil than you. We sought the same thing, to save humanity, ridding them of their painful, no. stupid, pointless lives. Mandus, stop. Think about what you are doing. For your children, Mandus. Do not speak of my children. Don't stop. I did not kill your children, Mandus. You sacrificed them on the temple steps, knowing what the coming century would do to them. Your sons will drown, lungs full of mud and shrapnel on the banks of the song. You wanted to save them from the horror to come. That is the vision we shared. Everything we have built to avert this coming nightmare. You and I are one. We are the same. Our souls are this tangle. Deserve to make them free. Hey kids, what you doing? <clears throat> All right. <laughs> There's hardly even any room for commentary as long as I'm making progress. Oh goody! Mandis Processing Company. Whoa! So this is where the temple is. Shut up, kid. You're I dead. I stood knee deep in mud and bone and filled my lungs with mustard gas. I have seen two brothers fall. I have lain with holy wars and copulated with the autumnal fallout. I have dug trenches for the refugees. I have murdered dissidents where the ground never thaws and starved the masses into faith. A child's shadow burnt into the brickwork. A house of skulls in the jungle. The innocent, the innocent Manders trump and bled and gassed and starved and beaten and murdered and enslaved. This is your coming century. They will eat the Mandus. They will make pigs of you all. And they will bury their snaps into your ribs. And they will eat your hearts. <clears throat> if this is the guy, then who's the other one locked back there? <sighs> nah, this ain't the guy. I already passed the guy. <clears throat> 
At the end, when we were cold as the stone we had hewn his body from, when the lights were nearly all extinguished, we heard, in the silent distance, the man-pigs singing to one another. Then, as the last lights were gone, and we lay together in the deep, they drifted away, and all was silent. Such a silence I have never known. And as the dust settled on my open eyes, and we lay together embraced forever, I heard, miles above us, the sounds of the city turning over in its sleep. A church bell ringing out. And in that moment, the new century was born. Not even any of that. Oh, there it is. Well, that was great. And I just, I'm probably just gonna make this to like an hour, or ten minute special or something. Cause I think this was really worth it. I'm really glad I finished this. The story was pretty good, if you ask me. The voice acting and how everything went. <laughs> of course, I was expecting a lot more uh, puzzles and monster chases, so. I feel a little let down, but then again, uh, well, it's, that's what I came expecting. I was expecting the wrong three. That's a story for another time. It is, this is great. This was a great experience. I'm glad to have shared it with you all. And, to next time, goodbye.